So if you ever wanted to know what the suite looks like on Ovation of the Seas by Royal Caribbean, well, here you go. So I'll take you guys in the bathroom first. We have two sides to the bathroom, so this one has a beautiful tub. It was very, very clean, and they also offer you some soaps and shampoos and body washes and all that, so you really don't need to actually bring that. Um, just one less thing to actually, you know, pack. Then you have a rain shower. And like I said, the shampoos, the body washes, and conditioners, and it has a little seat in there. So it's pretty, pretty, pretty nice. Then over to the other side is where the actual toilet is located. So you can see that has a nice sink, mirror, toilet. Floors are nice, clean, and that's what's most important, the cleanliness of it. So then we have the lights, you know, I like to play with the little lights and you can turn them on and off and see. Um, so that's pretty cool. Then you have another light, which I was trying to figure out where it went and I didn't figure it out in time, but I actually did get it eventually, but you get the idea. So then you have storage and a safe. So this was used for dirty clothes or whatever you might want to use that space for. And you got a couple of drawers on the side of the bed. And then another light. I like playing with the lights, as you guys can see. The bed, I must say, was super cozy and comfortable. Wow. That's really, really not something that I typically say. And then over here, you have more storage for all of your clothes. They offer you two robes to use on your stay on the cruise. So that was awesome. Very soft. We're Caribbean guys. Okay. Hangers, and I use all of them. I mean, I probably should have went to somebody else's cabin and used more because I always overpack. But anyway, the TV um, and the drawers are here. You get a blow dryer in here. So that's pretty cool. I didn't really use that protective styles when we go away. And you got your little mini fridge under here. And it's empty. So you got to put your own stuff in there. Um, Coffee maker. I don't drink coffee. But hey, for those that drink coffee, perfect for them. Then you got your plugs over here and a desk, which is pretty cool. Got a little table and a couch, and that actually opens up, I think. I never tried it, but I think it does. Of course, you know, I gotta have the side of the bed with the plug because I always have to do content and have my phone and iPad and laptop plugged in. But then you get out here to the balcony, and it is, uh, this is where I spent really a lot of my time. Now, we were just now boarding, we had just boarded the ship. So we were still in Seattle, but even this was a beautiful view. So I loved every bit of it. This was my first cruise. Um, it probably won't be my last, but yeah, that's the balcony. And then back to the suite. I mean, listen, it was a very, very cozy, comfortable stay. It's beautiful. The room is beautifully decorated. It's clean. And I, I keep saying clean because it's really important to have a clean uh, sweet. So yeah, 